Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to be looking at the players that have been revealed that you're going to be getting out of the Masterful Presence. We know all of them now, except for the Masterful Present 3. So we'll, go, we'll be going through that and we'll also be taking a quick look at the brand new Patrick Willis that is in the game for our Ghosts of Madden. So the way that you're going to see these is you're going to go into Ultimate Freeze, go down to Rewards right below me, go into Rewards, and they will be right there. So I posted screenshots of these on my Instagram, so you can go and look at that as well, at jam21yt. But we'll take a look at them right here. So we had the quarterback Tim Tebow as the normal master out of the masterful present. I don't know which number is which, but whichever one has the player's number, so whichever one has the 15 on it, you're going to be getting a fullback Tim Tebow. I don't think a lot of people saw the, this combination of positions coming, but we're going to be getting a fullback Tim Tebow. I don't really care, to be honest. Um, there's two cards that I'm most excited about and one that I'm very disappointed about. So the Tim Tebow, we'll take a quick look at stats. 86 speed, which is higher than the quarterback card. 86 strength, 94 carry, 88 trucking, 88 elusiveness, 90 excel, or, you know, decent stats. Not amazing. It's a fullback. No one really cares about a fullback, if I'm going to be honest. Okay. The next card we have, it is Randy Moss going from a wide receiver to quarterback. A lot of people thought this was going to be a cornerback. I I did too, but we're getting a quarterback instead. And let me tell you, this is insane because we have 92 speed, 94 excel at quarterback with this 93 overall. I don't know what that's going to go up to when you Evo it, but probably something insane. He also has 86 throw power, 84 accuracy short, 85 mid, 90 deep, 80 on the run, kind of terrible, but solid quarterback card and this would be super good for me because all i do is run the ball all day i need my quarterback to make two different throws and then be able to run a two-point conversion so that would be a solid quarterback for me but i'm not getting it because i already have a free quarterback now the card that i'm super super disappointed about is the william perry this is the most obvious one here you need to put this guy at halfback or at fullback and they put him at center like ea what are we doing here okay what are we doing center is one of the positions that we haven't had like a really good card there in a while i don't think um so it's good to get a nice center and this is gonna have only 63 speed 82 excel though is pretty good 95 strength 92 awareness 89 run block 94 pass block 95 impact block some pretty good stats there except for run block which kind of sucks um but you know a cool card but I'm really disappointed about this because this should have been 100% a halfback or a fullback and it's not. It's just not. So I'm not liking that. I'm really liking the Moss. Really good stats there, especially with so much speed, 92 on a quarterback. And the other card that I really like is Sean Taylor. I always love any Sean Taylor card. So I knew I was going to like this card no matter where it was at. I was thinking maybe halfback or linebacker. They go with a linebacker Sean Taylor and it looks great. And the stats are really good as well. 90 speed, 94 excel, 90 tackle, 90 wears, 85 man, 93 zone on a linebacker, and then 86 block shed, 94 pursuit, and you know he's going to have some really good hit power as well. So I'm really impressed with the Sean Taylor linebacker and the Randy Moss quarterback. I'm surprised by the Randy Moss quarterback a bit, a bit surprised by the Tebow fullback, and very surprised by the William Perry at center instead of halfback or fullback. Really disappointed about that, but those are the brand new cards, and we'll we'll go over to the presents. If we go into news here, if it'll if it'll let me click it, we look at the masterful presents. If I can find them, They're, the the news the news tab for them is gone. Um, are they in? Are the masterful presents in rewards here? They're not. Okay, so whatever masterful presents there are, whatever number it has. So if it has the number fifteen in the picture, you're going to be getting a fullback Tim Tebow. If it has 81, you're going to be getting a quarterback, Randy Moss. 72 is going to give you the center, William Perry. And 21 will give you the Sean Taylor linebacker. I think the best ones are the Randy Moss and the Sean Taylor. I think Sean Taylor is better because he's at a position where you don't already have a free card there. So that's what I would want. These players are already... Um, I'm saying that wrong. I'll get to that. There's another player that's already on the auction house that we'll talk about in a second. But those are the cards. So we know what we're getting in four out of the five masterful presents. For the fifth one, though, number three, we don't know yet. So I'm speculating, could it be a select, maybe, of these uh, four cards? Could it be maybe a ghost player? Could it be multiple 
diamond players, uh, maybe multiple out of position players. Um, who knows? Uh, that's what I'm speculating, but we will have to see tomorrow. For now, we have those four players, and I do want to briefly talk about the brand new content that is in the game today. Aside from that, which is our first ghost player, it says the first ghost of Madden present. This is a ghost of Madden past with the Patrick Willis here. 94 overall, 160 power, middle linebacker. Take a quick look at stats, 90 speed, 94 excel, 93 strength, 94 awareness, 95 tackle, 87 zone, 96 play rec, 94 pursuit. Really, really, really good stats there on the middle linebacker card. And we can read on the right side, it says Patrick Willis has appeared for a limited time, and this is very, very limited. Find him in Ghost of Madden Past Blitz event in Ultimate Freeze until 4 p.m. Eastern time. That's literally just like a few hours. Um, and then also Ghost of Madden Past Willis Store offer, which is a four times value, blah, blah, blah. Spend some money on the game. You can get that. And the ghost vanishes at 6 p.m. Eastern time. So this thing is literally out for a matter of hours. I'm wondering if maybe we will get a second uh, Ghost uh, of Madden Past today if we'll get two today and then maybe two present ones on christmas day and then two future ones the day after not sure that's what i'm speculating but we will have to see for now we got the brand new patrick willis in the game and that that's who i was saying is already on the auction house if we come over here and we go like this and we go patrick willis you already see this sum up uh lowest one is like 14k that's probably going to settle to around 10 to 15 mil right there. But that's pretty much it. And I'll just show you the live event. It's this one right here. And then one more thing I'll throw. I'll just throw everything into the same video here. This is the event. When you play it for the first win, you get 100 pro Gold stamina. So make sure you do that. And then every win will give you a chance at the Patrick Willis. So make sure you play this at least once. Get 100 pro Gold stamina. And then as many times after that that you want. And then the pro, the new event on the left is Santa's Challenge coming soon. That That's all it says. That's where we're probably going to be getting our Santa's hat, which goes into the like tree topper set, whatever it's called. But for now, we have the out of position masterful present players revealed. We have our first ghost of Madden, and that's pretty much it. Let me know in the comments which one of these out of position players you like the most, which one you want, um, if you could get one, and what you think will be in the masterful present. Three. I already said what I thought. I want to hear what you guys think. For now, that is going to be it for this video. I streamed this morning. Thank you to everybody who was there. I'm going to be posting the predictions video later today. So please give that a watch if you're interested. But that is going to be it for this video. I think that's like the third time I've said that or something. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe as always. And I'll see you next time.